Hey everybody, Mr. Washam here with a quick tutorial on how to use Screencastify to turn your Chromebook camera into a webcam and make a video. So when you go to the Chrome Web Store, you're going to search for Screencastify, all one word, S-C-R-E-E-N-C-A-S-T-I-F-Y, Screencastify. Um, you're not looking under the apps, you look under the extensions and there you'll see Screencastify, Screen Video Recorder, and you will need to add to the Chrome. All right, once you add that, the extension will be added to the top of your page up here with your extensions. And so you can see Screencastify, I've got a red dot because it's currently recording. Uh, but Screencastify will be a little black um, film strip looking uh, type icon. And so when you click on Screencastify, it will load some options for you. And you can see that I'm currently recording my desktop. However, for the purpose of this activity, we don't want to record the desktop. What we want to record is what you see right here. You just want to use the camera to record what is in front of your Chromebook. And that's how I use the camera to record the video about the sweet potato. So when you click on Screencastify for the first time, you'll have an option that says uh, there's three options at the top. There's one option that says tab. The middle option says desktop. And the third option says camera. And so you want to use... You want to use the uh, camera to record. And so that's what I was doing right here. And whenever you're done recording, there'll be a box on your screen and you click simply click the stop button, which I'm going to do right now, and it'll stop recording the video. So once you um, click stop, this is the page that loads. And so it loads a page where it shows the video just you just recorded which you can play. However, for the purpose of this activity, we don't want to record the desktop. What we want to record is what you see right here. You just want to use the camera to record. And so it'll show you a preview of that. And this is how you get the video onto YouTube. So what you do now is the first thing you want to do, it'll say Untitled Screencast up here. So you'll go up here and you'll want to rename it and name it uh, appropriately for the name of the video. And then you go to your sharing options. And under your sharing options, you want to make sure you share it on YouTube. And then you go down here and under privacy, uh, you can make it public or unlisted. That's uh, up to you. You can make it one or the other. Please don't make it private or we won't be able to see it. So public means anybody can view the video on YouTube. Unlisted simply means what it says that they have to have the link in order to view it. So whichever one you choose, um, you go ahead and click um, upload. Uh, you'll have the upload option and it will upload it for you to YouTube. So once it's done, this little icon will appear over here that says it's been uploaded to YouTube. So you click on YouTube and that will take you to your account where your video was uploaded. And so you can see here that I have the video uploaded now on YouTube. However, for the purpose of this activity, we don't want to record the desktop. What we want to record is what you see right here. You just want... So you can see the videos now on YouTube. Uh, what I would suggest you do is go to your video manager and you'll want to make sure that you do a couple things underneath video manager. You want to go to that video and you want to edit it. The first thing you'll want to do is probably make sure that you uh, turn comments off. That way people cannot comment on your video. So you'd click edit. And this will take you to the edit screen. If you want to select a different uh, thumbnail icon that will appear with the video, you can do that. So here I'm going to select a different thumbnail. And then I'm going to select a different thumbnail. And then I'm going to go down here and make sure underneath basic info that the title is correct, that it is unlisted. If you make playlists, you can add it to a different playlist. And so like on this one, this one goes with the greenhouse projects. Uh, I'm actually going to make mine public because I need you guys to be able to see it and find it. And you go to advanced settings. And under advanced settings, here's where you can turn the comments off because you don't need people commenting on your video. And the other thing I always do is I always go to recording date and I just choose today to make that. All right, the very last thing you got to do is choose publish and it will fully publish the video to YouTube. This is your video URL right here. And so you click on the video URL and you can copy that. Control C copies. You would then go to your website and you edit the page. 
And once the video editor loads, uh, we're going to put this video in. And so I'll go to Insert, YouTube, and here you can paste the URL, Control-V, and there it pasted. it. If you want the video and title to go away, just uncheck them and choose Save. And there it is, put the video onto my page, and when I hit Save, there the video will load. and it will play directly from your website. However, for the purpose of this activity, we don't want to record the desktop. What we want to record is what you see right here. You so that is how you use Screencastify to create a video using the webcam on your Chromebook and get it published onto your Google site through YouTube. If you have any questions, please be sure and ask.